ancient Greeks, and other civilizations. Here are the contributions of the Greeks. Leucippus and Democritus. They propose the idea that all things are made up of much smaller things that cannot be divided or changed. They were two of the most significant Greek theorists. They believe that atoms, make up most of the things in the universe, and if there are no atoms, there is a void. Atoms comes from atomos which means uncuttable. Anaxagoras. He proposed that there was an infinite number of elementary natural substances that is infinitesimally small. These substances comprise the different things in the universe. Empedocles. He argued that everything is made up of four eternal and unchanging kinds of matter. Plato. He proposed that the four kinds of matter is comprised of geometrical solids, also known as platonic solids, which can be further divisible into triangles. Plato further stated that when these triangles are rearranged, they could cause the apparent transformations, between the four basic kinds of matter. Aristotle He believed that the four elements could be balanced in substances in an infinite number of ways, and that when combined, gave proportions of essential qualities, hot, dry, cold, and wet. Aristotle further explained that the transformations between the four elements, or the changes in their balance, brought the changes in the universe. Let us now see the contributions of other civilizations to development of science. Mesopotamians They assigned certain symbols to match metals with the heavenly body such as the sun and moon. Mesopotamians also had techniques to utilize metals like gold and copper. They also made use of other materials such as dyes, glass, paints, and perfumes. Egyptians They adapted techniques from the Mesopotamians, and perfected the use of bronze, dye, and glass, that the Greeks later copied. Chinese They had their own processes for metalwork and ceramic materials. They especially focused on finding minerals, plants, and substances that could prolong life. The discoveries of the Chinese have been found to have actual positive medicinal effects. However, others were found harmful, like mercury. Indians They use a kind of alchemy, Rasayana, that uses different substances and practices. This practice is closely related to Hindu and Buddhist beliefs. The Indians also perfected the use of iron and steel, and were well-known manufacturers of dyes, glass, cement, solutions for textiles, and soap. The Arabs and Muslims They translated the practices and Aristotelian thinking of the Greeks, and wrote extensively on how metals can be purified.
The Arabs and Muslims also came up with the preparation of acids, such as nitric, hydrochloric, and sulfuric acids, as well as aqua regia, or nitrohydrochloric acid.